not that long ago, the public requested that we have more in a la carte version of television channel, and we started breaking the cable TV foothold on television. The results were streaming services, started with a few, like Netflix and Amazon Prime, and now there seems to be a new one coming up every other week, from Disney Plus to DC Universe to Warner Brothers HBO Max to whatever NBC Universal is doing. Here at the Fanatarium, we will be breaking down these streaming services, some free, some paid, some in between, if you never heard of some of them. When we're done with all these episodes, you'll be able to decide which ones you like, which ones you don't, and if there's a hidden gem out there that you can try. Hopefully, saving you some money, or at least using it more wisely. Welcome to the Fanatarium. This is Con TV. It is a streaming service that is designed to help the geek. It is full of B-movies, science fiction, fantasy, and other genre. There are comics on here, and the main goal of them is to basically satisfy your needs. A lot of these are independent films, and a lot of the comics that they have are independent ones. As you noticed, there's a variety. Um, not all of these movies have you actually heard of, but, you know, they're some of them are basically the type of movie that I'd watch anyway. Um, you know, they're super shark. You know, so, but there's a lot of variety from horror to action and so on. So, what about as it says, Con TV is the digital destination for Comic Con fans. Devoted to all the weird, hilarious, and terrifying content celebrated at the cons, Con TV is a place to celebrate community, discover new movies and TV series, and revel in being a fan. We've got thousands of hours of programming on the server, so if horror is your thing, you're covered. Sci fi, tons of it. Do you want classic or modern? Anime, martial arts, cult films? Check, 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 and check. Postmodern, independent, deco punk? Now you're just trying to mess with us, but guess what? We've got that too. We're betting you're going to find something cool to watch on Con TV no matter what you're into. Con TV is a partnership with Cinedime, an industry leader in independent content distribution, and Wizard World, the largest Comic Con producer in the U.S. Uh, so, for this one, discover a universe of elusive and exclusive programming, including original shows, genre movies, cult series, user generated content, Comic Con events. Pick your poison. We got anime, fantasy, gaming, grindhouse, horror, martial arts, sci fi superheroes, and all other genres that keep you drooling. We're always adding content to the service, so email us if you have recommendations. So, they have their little thing. So, what exactly is it? As we know, as we just said, we know what there is. They do have ads. Um, it is available, though, on Android, iOS, mobile, tablet device, Roku, and so on. So if you don't want to have ads, you can pay $6.99 a month and watch ad-free. Otherwise, it's like TV and their ads to support basically what they do. So let's look at some of the movies. Takes a little bit to load on my computer. I am sorry. So... Some of these movies, I, well, actually, I've not heard of any of these ones yet, but you notice there is a variety. A lot of these ones are the ones you see just at Comic-Cons, basically, you know, the type of ones that you've never really seen elsewhere, but that is not a bad thing, necessarily. It's not a Tupac movie. It's a Princess of Mars. Um, I did not know another Princess of Mars movie existed. Terminators. You know, that, that sort of variety. TV shows, though, is uh, kind of a different story. I actually kind of love what they did in the TV shows. So TV shows, notice here they have anime, they have classic television, they have Superman right there, um, they have Turbo Fantasy, they have uh, more anime, Bubblegum Crisis right there, uh, science fiction, fantasy, conspiracy theories, aliens, Mummies Alive, Down on Squad, Watership Down, that's a happy show, you know, where in the world come San Diego, Beyblade, there's just a lot of variety on here that I think you'll enjoy, My Morphing Life, seasons, all three seasons of My Morphing Life, more Yu-Gi-Oh's on here, Song of the Hedgehog. There's just a lot of cool little stuff. There's stuff that's free all the time um, for everyone. You know, it's that person right there. Elijah Woods, right there. So, I'll, this basically, if you think of something that would be at Comic Con, this is it. Without the multi million dollar show. So, think of stuff that would be at Comic Con outside of Hall H, outside of the mega stage. That's what this is. They have a little bit of everything, and if it's interesting to you, it is available at Con TV.